Welcome back to my AP Calculus class. Today I'm going to keep explaining about how to use basic formulas for integral with use substitution. So example 4 is about use substitution problem. I'm going to explain what is use substitution with the basic formulas, okay? So first problem is finding integral. It says integral 2 times 1 minus 3x whole things square dx. So use substitution to use, use substitution, you have to make a part of the function become u part. So in this case, u part, I'm gonna let u part 1 minus 3x. And the second step, use substitution of the second step, you change this given x function to u function. U g fx is a given, right? Just to change fx to u function. So because I let 1 minus 3x is u part, integral 2 times u square dx. When you change the x function to u function, dx should be changed to du. dx should be changed to du. How? We use this function, u equals 1 minus 3x. So find that derivative of each side. 1 times du is equal to negative 3 times dx. So what is the dx equals? dx equals negative 1 third du. dx is always 1 over derivative of u part, 1 over derivative of u part du. All right? So dx is what? 1 over derivative of u part, in this case, 1 over negative 3 u okay so 2 times 1 negative third is negative 2 third and then integral u square du to find the integral of u square du you use just power right x to the nth power's integral was 1 over n plus 1 times u to the n plus 1 power plus c so n is 2 in this case so negative 2 third times 1 over 2 plus 1 times u to the 2 plus 1 plus c. This is the 1 third, right? 2 third times 1 third negative 2 over 9 times u to the third power plus c. And then you have to bring the u part back here because u was 1 minus 3. 3x. So you're going to use 1 minus 3x. So I'm going to replace u substitutes 1 minus 3x for u. Negative 2 over 9 times 1 minus 3x cubed plus c. This is the answer. I'll give you a tip. If u part is a linear function from like this problem, is 1 minus 3x is a linear function, right? If u part is mx plus b form, you can use that u substitution with the linear function anytime. Anytime you can use u for the linear function part. All right, but next example is not, you know, u part is not a linear function part, so just should be a little different. Let's go to example five. Just to find these functions, integral. 2x cubed minus 1 whole thing to fifth power times x squared dx. I will let 2x cubed minus 1, that part become u. And then I will change this function to u function. So integral, because 2x cubed minus 1 is u, u to the fifth powers times x squared dx. But we cannot change x squared to u function. That is literally impossible. Just leave it. But this part should be crossed out when you change dx to du. I told you dx is always what? 1 over derivative of u part, which is 6x squared times du. dx is always what? 1 over derivative of u part, du. So replace dx with 1 over 6x squared times du. And then now this x squared, this x squared finally cross out. That function totally changed to u function. Okay? So 1 over 6 is kind of 
question code, go to the front, and then find that u to the fifth power is du. So 1 over n plus 1, 5 plus 1, times u to the 5 plus 1 plus c. So 1 over 6 times 1 over 6, 1 over 36 times u to the 6 powers plus c. And then what was u? u was 2x cubed minus 1. So bring it back here. So substitute 2x cubed minus 1 for u. And then you're going to find the final answer. That's this. Okay. What about example 6? Example 6 is still u substitution. Just to find the integral of cube root 1 minus x dx. I will add 1 minus x. That part is u. So that will be integral cube root to u and then the x is always what 1 over derivative of u part that means negative 1 right negative 1 times the u because this is a linear form the u part is linear for any time you can use u for the linear function form so negative 1 integral cube root to u the u to the one third the power d u n is one third so what's the formula n plus one one third plus one times u to the one third plus one plus c so negative it is negative three over five three over five three over four i'm sorry three over four times u to the four over three plus c and then what was u it was one minus x negative 3 over 4 times 1 minus x 4 over 3 plus c is the final answer okay let's go number example 7 which part gonna be u part this u part is not linear function part but you're gonna when you change the dx to du, you're gonna multiply one over derivative of u part. In this case, if this part u part, mm, derivative of u part negative eight x. But this x and another x in the bottom gonna be cross out. Okay, I'll show you now. So I'm gonna let three minus four x square is a u part. Okay, so I change this function to u function now integral integral x over square root to u times change dx to du dx is always one over u prime in this case this function is derivative negative 8x negative 8x times du and then this x and this x and cancel out so negative 1 over 8 goes to the front and then integral u to the 1 over u to the 1 half power, so negative 1 half power, du, and then u to power, 1 over 8, 1 over n plus 1 times u to the n negative 1 half plus 1 powers. Okay, so negative 1 over 8 times this part is 2. 1 over 1 half, that's 2, times u to the 1 half powers. So what is the answer? This part is negative 1 over 4. What was u? u was 3 minus 4x squared. So 1 half power minus square root, right? Square root of 3 minus 4x squared plus c. This is the final answer. Next problem, example 8, you keep doing what? U substitution. Which part is in this case? x cubed minus 1 is u. How can you cross out 4x squared? Yeah, that can be crossed out when you change dx to d, dx to du. 1 over u prime du. u prime is 3x squared, right? That x squared and this x squared at the top will now be crossed out. I'm going to show you how to. 
integral 4x square over u cube and then dx is what? 1 over u prime which is 3x square du and then these two cross out so 4 over 3 can go to front the integral 1 over u cube that means u to the negative third du by the power root 1 over n plus 1 times u to the n plus 1 plus c this part negative 1 half negative 1 half times 4 over 3 negative 2 third then u to the negative 2 plus c what was u? u was x cubed minus 1 and the negative second power is 1 over positive square right positive second power so 1 over u squared then u is x cubed minus 1 square plus c so this is the final answer all right i will stop here because next video explain the other example problems from example 9. thank you so much for watching my video and then please click subscribe and like and turn on the notification thank you so much again bye bye